Now our circuit is almost complete. We just need to feed signal to gates of MOSFETs. So, I designed the simple inverter driver using TL494IC, which operates on 12 volts DC supply and gives two output signals. Also with this potentiometer output frequency can be adjusted. And these transistors amplify the output signal to MOSFETs. Then signal goes to gates of MOSFETs, which we already made. And MOSFETs output is fed to high frequency transformer, with these winding configurations. For easy assembly, I converted driver schematics into the PCB layout. And the PCB is going to be look like this. You can download both circuit diagram and PCB files, link is in video description. In order to manufacture this PCB, go to the video description, and with this link sign up on JLCPCB website. On the homepage of JLCPCB website, here you can add the Gerber file I provided. After uploading, you can see the preview of the PCB. You can also change quantity in the color of PCBs as per your requirements. And then saved a card for checkout. Within some days I got my order from JLCPCB delivered. The quality of the PCBs is amazing, and they offer 5 pieces of 6 layer PCBs for just $2. And now it is time to assemble the PCB. So, let's place all the components on the PCB according to the circuit diagram. And after spending some time with the soldering process, I cleaned the PCB with isopropyl alcohol. And here our PCB is looking nice and clean. Now grab the TL494IC and install into the IC base. Solder the input and output pads. Solder the connection wires. Now before we install this driver, we need to connect multimeter to the output of this driver. Connect the 12 volt DC input. And set meter on the frequency mode. Using the screwdriver, adjust the potentiometer anti-clockwise, and set the frequency of 35 kHz. Fix some double-sided foam tape, on the back of the PCB. and place it over here. Connect the signal output wires to gate resistors. And connect driver input DC wires with installed capacitor. Use a bulb holder. And solder on output of this transformer. I will use this 100 watt bulb for testing. Connect the DC supply positive with transformer center wire. And connect negative with source of all MOSFETs. As you can see it works perfectly. You can connect more load, by using the 12 volt battery as input source. I will connect another 100 watt bulb on output of the transformer. Now connect with battery. As you can see, it works perfectly, both bulbs are glowing very bright, and more load can be connected. Since this is very efficient inverter, but it operates on the high frequency, this will be very useful for the lighting applications only. Also I would like to let you know that, JLC PCB offers high quality 6 layer PCBs in affordable prices and discounts.
Sixth layer PCB design can be very useful in high speed performing applications and for optimized routing efficiency and electrical performance. So, give life to your new six layer PCB design with only JLC PCB. If you enjoyed the video, give a thumbs up. For more useful videos, subscribe the channel. Also check out these recommended videos. Thanks for watching.